reduction in target cells, both in cell culture and in animals. More protein was made from each delivered mRNA molecule, and the laureates carefully dissected the cellular pathways involved. Carrico and Weissman made fundamental discoveries of the importance of base modifications in mRNA, which eliminated a major obstacle to mRNA-based clinical applications. Building upon this mRNA technology, as well as research by others on stabilized spike protein and mRNA delivery using lipid nanoparticles, two highly effective mRNA vaccines against COVID-19 were developed and approved in record time. Importantly, the two mRNA vaccines had complete substitution of uridines for a pseudouridin variant in the sequence coding for the spike protein. mRNA vaccines, together with other COVID-19 vaccines, have been administered over 13 billion times. Together they have saved millions of lives, prevented severe COVID-19, reduced the overall disease burden, and enabled societies to open up again. The successful mRNA vaccines against COVID-19 have had a tremendous impact on the interest in mRNA-based technologies. mRNA technologies are now being used to develop vaccines against other infections. The technology may also be used for therapeutic protein delivery and cancer treatment in the hope of further improving human health. Here are the two Nobel laureates.